So how it started was, you know, I was teaching my grandchildren to play with Lego. You know, I'd show them how to build certain things and whatever. And I just noticed at one point that there was a bunch of bricks that never got used for anything. You know, we'd use this style of brick. And these other ones are sort of unloved over to the side. And so I said, I wonder if I could build something with this. And I, I was on the internet one day and I saw this guy holding a Chicago Blackhawks logo, like the big Indian head. And he's holding it in his hands like this. And I'm like, I think I could do that. I think I could put that together. So based on the photograph, I built my very first uh, Lego wall, I guess you'd call it. Yeah, I had Legos when I was a kid in the 60s, the first little sets. You had white, you had red, you had blue couple colors and uh, we'd build with them and you know we we're fascinated with them but you know once I was a teenager I got on to other things and I literally didn't do anything with them for so I was in my 50s <laughs> so yeah that it was just I always enjoyed it but you know life interfered with other passions and so um, really only pulled them out when my daughter was young and then when my grandkids were young and show them what I knew. So in terms of hours, because I don't build them like straight through, I'll, I'll just start them and I'll walk away and I'll come back tomorrow and do it. So a piece like, like this one here, eight hours maybe. So I would say the average is eight to 12. And then the largest pieces, like maybe this one, and there's a couple in there that are pretty big, they t they'll take maybe 15, you know. So if I had to, I could start early in the morning, I start at 4 a.m. I could finish any piece in here in one day. If I, that's all I did. I just dedicated myself. My wife brings my lunch. I just sit there and, and, and I could finish it, any piece in here in one day. So I'll, be, I'll pull up a, sort of a plan of how I need to build this. It'll, it'll have exactly what it's going to look like. Um, it, the plan won't tell me how to build it, though. I still have to do, make decisions about how to make it stronger, how to make it you know, get more support so when I stand it up, it doesn't just all fall apart. I had that happen a few times in the early days, and so you develop little tricks to sort of brace things and use smaller bricks to kind of make things stronger. Um, but yeah, I just start, you know, I use the plane, I start somewhere in about the middle of the piece, I work my way up, and then when I get to the end of the table, I push it up and start throwing it in the bottom. And that's how they get done.